Anthony, this is quite some story. It's almost ridiculous. A debut back in 1996, and here you are, back in the big time at the Crucible for the first time in 12 years. Extraordinary. Yeah, 2008, wasn't it? I, I, I yep. think we lost to uh, Maguire, who battered me, I think. But it's funny because uh, I'd been in the, the Crucible 12 out of 13 years straight, and it was part of my life, you know, it was part of the, the whole drive to Sheffield, it was all part, you know, and then you get the 13 or 14 weeks off the old days. So that was part of my life for, uh, for 13, 14 years, and then and now 12 years without it. So it's been weird. Um, I've had some twitch ups uh, last, last rounds on that to qualify. But I know today um, I played quite nice. Why are things clicking again? They're not clicking, no. I'm just, um, um, I've got a great attitude. My game is not good, but my attitude, uh, because of that, my attitude's got to be the best in the room. That's what I aim for, is to have the best attitude in the room, because I have to make up the difference some, somehow, you know. So you've got a maturity and perhaps a sense of perspective that you may not have had over defeats 10, 15 years ago. Well, it's, it's a standard of snooker, you know, when you're a good player, it's hard to take playing bad, because you've got high expectations. And then when you start to struggle, you can either get cheesed off all the time or just come to terms with feeling bad often and just treat it as part of, part of what you're going to face. OK, but come on. You've come through the cauldron of qualifying. You wouldn't be walking down those steps at the Crucible if you didn't think you could win that first round match, whoever comes out of the hat, surely. Uh, first round is always a chance, yeah, because uh, the top 16 are never comfortable first first match. Uh, it's a shorter match. Uh, to be honest, if you've got, if you've got Ronnie uh, or Judd, you've got to play lights out, or Neil or someone like that. You've got to play lights out. And that is the place you can, it, it can bring it out of you, you know, especially my age. But um, it's, it'll be nice to go there. It's a bit, it's a bit of a shame that uh, it's in this current climate, you know, uh, with it being, you know, half em mostly empty and that. But um, well, I like, listen, it is nice. It, 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 it could be two thirds empty or it could be one third full. Yeah. I, I reckon I'm going to try and work the crowd so that it's one third full. Yeah. Um, in terms of records, I know Alan McManus likes a stat. He's currently playing as we're talking now, so we don't know at the moment whether he's going to get over the line. As we speak now, you're the oldest guy who will have appeared at the Crucible since the Nugget in 2010. So there's, an, there's another little slice of history for you. Yeah, yeah, I mean, but these are, these are these history-making things for the age groups are, are happening all the time now because, you know, obviously we're all still playing our half decent. Some of the, some of the, a lot of the 16 are over 40, aren't they now? So, um, you know, uh, it just seems like the class of 91, 92, 93 is still the best, is still the best out there. And um, if you've got some bottle and you've got and you and you've got a bit of work ethic, you can still win a lot of matches. How much will it mean to you to walk out? And, and hear the appreciation, albeit from 300 instead of 950, after all those years of, of it not being part of your life? Yeah, it'll be good. Yeah, it'll be good. Um, it'll be weird. Uh, it's, it'll be half like the first time there, you know. I don't know how the setup's going to be. I wouldn't imagine they've got us sitting next to each other like, like we normally have. We I, I, that won't be happening, will it? So no. it will be weird that you're not sitting next to your, your opponent. Because uh, that's part of the crucible, you know. You can hear them breathing. You can hear them. You can hear them uh, twitching and, and like moaning and uh, gr gr grumbling to themselves. Um, so that will be different. But yeah, it's going to be a buzz, isn't it? It's, cru it's a crucible. Uh, it's going to be great. You know, it's 20 grand on the ranking list. It's all good. Many congratulations. I cannot wait to give your introduction. Whoever you face. Yeah. Have a good one. Thanks, Rob. Thank you. Cheers. Cheers, pal.